Hey guys, Tech with a video for you guys. In today's video, I want to show you how to fix your AirPods if Siri is not working on them. So by default, Siri should work where you can say, hey Siri, and it should be able to allow you to do commands like you would be from your AirPods. Sometimes that doesn't work, and the reason why it doesn't work could be a couple of reasons, and we're going to show you how to troubleshoot and fix that issue. So let's get started. So first reason why you might not be getting uh, Siri to respond from your AirPods are not working is because you may not have Siri turned on. And it's simple as just simply going to your settings here. And then all you do here in your settings, look for Siri and search and ensure that listen for Hey Siri is turned on because this needs to be turned on for Siri to recognize your voice. So in order to set it up, you'll need to go through this command. So I'll go through here. Hey Siri. Hey Siri, send a message. Hey Siri, how's the weather today? Hey Siri, set a timer for three minutes. Hey Siri, play some music. So as you can see here, I went through and set it up for listening for Hey Siri. And the reason why you need to do that because when you're using Hey Siri or the Siri command on your uh, AirPods, it needs to constantly listen for it and you may not have that turned on. So make sure that is turned on. Also press side button and then allow Siri one lock. All these three options should be turned on so that you can actually get Siri to activate from your AirPods. Now moving on to the next thing in your phone. If your Siri isn't working, it's checking the actual connectivity of your AirPods. So for this one, you're going to want to go to your Bluetooth or the option here for your AirPods and we're going to go ahead and check this one which is the microphone itself. So there's a microphone setting. You're going to click on that. Now with the microphone you want to be selecting the very first option which automatically switches AirPods and this option is required because if you have it for left or right it might not pick up Hey Siri command. So you want to make sure again it is set automatically just the way we have it in this setting. Now after you have done that and you're still having the issue, the next thing to check in your settings of your phone is around if you have any content restriction on your phone. So in order to check that, you're going to go ahead, go in your settings here, just like I have it here, and you're going to look for screen time. And once you look for screen time, what well, you're going to look for content and privacy restriction. Now, if you don't have screen time turned on, you can skip this step because it won't apply to you. But if you do have it turned on and you see where it has a content restriction on under allowed apps, you want to make sure that Siri and search is turned on. For some reason, it's turned off like that. Hey, Siri will no longer work. So you're going to turn that on and say, hey, Siri, so it can pick up any Siri commands from your AirPods. Now, after you have checked that and ensured that it's turned on for it, if you have content and restriction, you can also try turning it off completely here if you don't want that content and restriction, if that's an option for you. The next thing you want to check out is on your phone here is going to doing a reconnect or resetting of your AirPods. And to do that, you're going to want to disconnect completely and forget the AirPods itself. So to do that, you're going to go into Bluetooth here and click on that eye icon for your connected AirPods right and go all the way down here and then the option here where it says forget this device you're going to click on that forget that device and then click on forget device and that does is just removes the device from your uh, the airpods from your iphone and we're going to reconnect it again and to reconnect it again make sure your airpods are charged up and then you want to just open the lid here just like that and it'll ask you to connect so we're going to hit that connect and then we're going to hold that button here like it says so you can reconnect it again on the back here and it should reconnect again just like that and when it's, it does that you're going to hit continue here and you should have now hey siri possibly able to work on your uh, airpods now let's say you did that and it's still not working the next thing to do is updating your airpods software or the firmware on it and you might wonder how do you do that well that is done through the device that your AirPod is connected to. So in order to update the firmware of your AirPods, you want to go to the settings here and update your iPhone or if you're using a MacBook, whatever device you have, make sure that it is up to date the latest version of software. So for your iPhone, if it's connected, you're going to go into settings and then you're going to go to general software update and it will check for updates here and you want to update it. What happens is when the phone's software is updated, it also holds the 
update or the firmware update for your AirPods. So if there's any issues with the AirPods, that update should be fixing it. And to check what update your AirPods have, you can check that by going into your settings here, with Bluetooth, and then your connected device. And then if you go all the way down where it's about page, you can see the version. By clicking on version, you'll see here there's a version for our AirPod. That's the firmware version. And if you click on here, take note of that version, where it's going to take you to the firmware of your AirPod and then look to see what the latest firmware version is. So for your AirPods, for this one, we have the second generation AirPods Pro here, which is 5E135. We go back to our setting and verify it's the latest version. If it's not the latest version, you're going to have to, again, make sure that your phones or your device software is updated and then connect these AirPods to charging and just be patient and wait for it because it will automatically update the firmware as long as your phone is up to date the latest version and the AirPods are plugged in and charging and it will just do it in within half an hour or sometimes even an hour and that will resolve any issue that you're having with Siri on your AirPods. And that's it for this video. That Those are hopefully going to be able to fix your Hey Siri command. Now for some reason if it's not working any longer your AirPods might be defective because the microphone sometimes can tend not to work so in that case you'll need to uh, take it to the Apple store and have them run a diagnostic. So hopefully this video is helpful. If so, please make sure that like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next time.